How do you justify the cost of free higher education on the state? Uh, South Africa can afford free higher education for poor and working class students. But importantly, the affordability or the feasibility uh, of free higher education goes beyond affordability. Uh, importantly, uh, free education is, some, is something that should not be interpreted through narrow budgetary lens. In other words, it's not a cost that you tick off your, 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 your balance sheet. In actual fact, uh, free education, particularly when it's invested to marginalized uh, uh, youth coming out of marginalized communities, becomes an investment with well-known economic social, cultural, and even political returns. So South Africa is in a position to afford free higher education for poor and working class students. How do you justify the cost of free higher education on the state? It is not a cost. In fact, South Africa will make money from free higher education. How? Uh, our economy is currently performing poorly as a result of low investment. Now. The question is, why do people not invest in South Africa? Because it's expensive to invest in South Africa. When you set up a factory in South Africa, you have to train hundreds of people before you run your operational. Before, and in addition, that, that workforce that is not trained is not as productive as the one that would be trained. So skilling the bulk of our population will make it cheaper to invest in South Africa, attract investment into South Africa, which will actually make money for South Africa, not take money away from South Africa. So there are many ways in which free higher education funds itself.